Dustin steps back, has some time. He throws. He's got a man, and that pass is caught. Yeah. By him, Kerrigan. On first and goal, it's Xavier Williams bouncing right side, cuts to the five, to the corner. He stood up, he backs up, spins into the end zone and scores! Don't get to him, and now Glass just takes off and tries to get as much as he can, which isn't much. Low snap, Crump digs it out of there, pivots, rolls right, still on his feet. He'll bounce to the five, he lunges to the line and scores! Oh, what a play by Dustin Crump, who should have been down about five times! Snap coming, fake to him. Crump looking left, turns, fires that way. Price comes back to grab it. Now he takes off the other way, 35-30. High, Aaron snap, he pulls it down on its way, and good. Same route, and the ball is picked off. Cracking near side, here's the snap from pivots right, face. Goes straight up the middle, spinning to the line, he scores! With nine seconds to spare. Flashes will receive the kickoff. And EMU does indeed take it deep. Parker from the four. Tries the far side numbers and slices his way through. One man to beat. Goodbye. Well, he may not be three archer, but he's not bad. How about that? Before the fans can even settle back into their seats, it's 30 to 14. Right side. Here's the turn and they give to Banga. To his left, to the 10. And it's first and goal. Trying to push Kent State out in front by eight. Adams to hold it, the kick is on its way right down the middle. Good, Glass from the middle, stepping, firing a missile, sliding pick, Keith Gerald Jr. with a second of the day. Victory formation. They're shaking hands, it's overtime. And you can hear the jubilation on that far sideline. The golden flashes, beaten by Eastern Michigan by eight a year ago. Today, return the favor, and they win three straight games in the month of November.